Ah, uh, it looks so cozy right now. Well, hello guys and welcome back to another video inside of my Bloxburg channel. I could call it my Bloxburg channel. I don't care at this moment. But hey guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel. And today I thought what we could do what we did last um, holiday, which was for Halloween, decorating my house for Halloween. We could decorate my house for Christmas. And right now I have my Christmas outfit on. So it's like my little reindeer and I love the new face that they released for um, dynamic faces. It just... It's like your the normal smile face, um, but it has rounded cheeks. So yeah, anyways, let's just get right in with this video today. So first things first is the Bloxburg update released yesterday. If you guys didn't see the video, um, I recorded it and posted it up. So I'm basically recording this a day after. Um, so basically all I did off camera was I just put some new snowy trees down. I'm probably going to put some more down later. Um, and I also, what I also did was I colored all of the plants and trees all colored white with the exception of a few plants, which this one I still got to color. Um, I forgot about that, but there's a few things I forgot to color that we can color when we get into build mode. So let's head into build mode. And if we go into my inventory, we're going to have like a lot of Christmas items now. Um, because I played through this update and I had like a ton of Christmas items. I mean, if you guys can see, one of the new update items was this brand new Christmas tree thing, which I think looks pretty nice. But it's not Christmas tree, it's this brand new little thing. So now, all we're gonna do is we're just gonna decorate this. We have our large plastic ornament, uh, it's a yard ornament. We have an illuminated tree, which we can put this in a room in the house. Um, all the Halloween, so we have these inflatables that we can put around. Am I thinking maybe I could put this inflatable over by my, um, just like right here, just having a nice little inflatable there. And you could also deflate these inflatables if you want. So that's always a nice addition. We have this classic sled that I'm planning on just putting right here because it is in the basement area. So we have this sled right here. We have a large Christmas tree, which I don't think it's going to fit. It's going to, it's not going to fit much in my living room. So which is why we have, which we have a giant colorful Christmas tree, which we could place around somewhere in this plot. But there's some new items that we can go in here to decorate. Um, what I'm planning on doing is ice covered edges along here. I want to place some nice ice covered edges. And if we use the basic, uh, basically um, having this be standard placement, um, or custom placement, like custom placement, like right now we're on standard placement. So if we have it on custom placement, we are not able to sadly, um, place, um, when we destroy this, we're, we are sadly not able to have this in our inventory. So I want to have as much of this in my inventory as possible. So I'm going to do right here is I'm just going to place this ice covered edges around this. And once this is all finished, I will come back, show you guys the nice ice covered edges. Okay, so now I have all the ice, no I don't. I don't have all the ice covered edges on all these other roofs. So basically all the ice covered edges are going on is all of these parts of the roofs. I thought I had it finished, but I didn't. I just have one more. I think this is the last one I have to do because I remember this one was one I didn't have before. And now I have it up on here. Um, in later episodes, then my decorating, redecorating my Black Star House will have more roofs to put this on. But yeah, now next, after the ice covered edge, we have a snow covered edge. And I want to put some of the snow covered edges all along this area right here. So all, all on the flatter parts of the roofs, basically all of this. This is for all of our um, snow covered edges are going to go, which I don't think we can use the scale tool on this. No, we cannot. That is a bummer. I'm just going to do it something like so, and I'm just going to cover all of these just like I did with those, and I will be back once this is all finished. 
Okay, so now the entire roof is now covered in snow edging. So all the exposed pieces, I decided to just outline it all in snow, just because it is like exposed. Just with all of those, I think for the next decorate redecorating my box for costumes, we're gonna do this so that we can finish this all up with snowy and icy stuff. Now we also have some brand new other stuff as well which is these icy icicles that i'm very excited to use so basically oops so basically what these icicles are is that we can place down some brand new icicles over here on like the roofs any place that we want to but basically it just looks like that there's just icicles growing from the ice i want to put these on just some places but not everywhere and if i want to put them everywhere um then i could but it's just i think that just looks super nice with this added touch of these icicles on this roof here and it just could be basically anywhere where this thing is growing and it just and like i could just place it as much as i want as little as i want any place i want it just touches on the roof which I think is a nice little addition to the game. So a lot of these new items I really, 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 really love. I think it just adds to the aspect that this game is just very amazing. And obviously there's a lot of stuff that I would like to see in next updates, and hopefully they do add those, um, which is more Christmas decoration stuff. Um, and also inclusive to other religions as well. I don't know if we have some of the stuff in inclusive to other religions that also um, celebrate a along this time as well. So if we do, then we do, but I would like to see some more inclusive stuff. Anyways, I'm just going to finish all of this and then I'll get back to you once all the icicles that I want are put on the roof. Okay, so I placed icicles everywhere on these roofs. Now there is this one thing that people did find that they use as a new hack which if you want to place some more stuff to have like snow looks like that it has like snow on it so for like this to look like that there's a snow on it um for these areas that just don't really get snow is that you can kind of use like these little blankets that have like snow on it and obviously we they also added in snow piles instead of for us just doing um regular things i just want to place some of the snow piles up here as well just looks like that it was snowing a lot um but just like you know just randomly place these everywhere that i can just so that it just looks like that there's just like a lot of snow and it just snowed a lot i think maybe that's good enough for the randomly placed stuff because i really like these new snow piles now that we have all that finished, we have some of the new items on there and some of the new stuff on there. We can go into our inventory once again. And I want to place some snowflakes in our just like, you know, little just like bare areas that have like nothing on it. So like this over here just adds some more snowflakes. And we have some gigantic wreaths. I think we have the decorative bows and everything. So let's just do wreath, large wreath. So like we can put like a wreath here, and I think yes, we can use the resize tool to resize all of this. So it can look like so, and I think that looks so pretty. Um, large gum drops. Ooh, we can put like some gun gum, gum drops right here, and a giant gum drop. Just make it look like it's decorated for Christmas a little bit. We can have a gingerbread man, which I can put right there, which looks so cute. Um, do we have like any snowmen? Or oh, we have shelf elf or elf on the shelf? Okay. We also have these window decals as well. You can just place around. Um, so I'm definitely gonna put some of these decals in the kitchen where I put some of the decals for um, Halloween. So I want to see something real quick. 
if I were to... We have some snowmen. Let's put some snowmen around. That looks cute. Um, a poinsettia. I usually put the poinsettia in here, but let's just not put that there yet. I have... So we have this table garland, which we'll put on later. This holiday mantle decor, which I think we can only put it on fireplaces. So if I go over here, yeah, it only goes on fireplaces. So that kind of sucks. Do you want to put this somewhere? Maybe put the inflatable. I want to put the inflatable somewhere where it could be visible. Maybe put the inflatable here. I think that will look cool if I put the inflatable look right here for the Christmas tree. Illuminated tree. Let's we can put this in our kitchen. Which if we just place it in which corner do we want to put it in? How about let's just put the illuminated tree like right here. I think that will look cool if we put the illuminated tree right there. And then we do have some more snowflakes that we can put around. Um, it maybe post them up on these little um, fireplace right here. I do want to put some of the stockings up so we can put maybe a stocking here, stocking here, stocking here, stocking here, stocking here, and then stocking there. How many stockings do we have left? We only have one stocking left. Now I want to see if I were to build structural items. Or do wooden plank and then this wooden plank. What if I were just to do a wooden plank right here? Uh, Color it like that, and then I were to go decorate special. So I can't put the garland on there. What if I wanted to put? Yeah, I can't put the mantle on there. So that is something I thought I could do. But what if I want to put? No, I can't put those on there because it's just a structural item. That sucks. Um, let me just do this right here as like garland. I'm definitely gonna just have to do it like so for the illuminated garland right here. I'll put like two illuminated garlands together. I think that would look cool. So basically, all of this is just placing down Christmas items, and snow piles around over here. Because I just wanted to look like that it snowed a lot and there's just like a lot of snow piles everywhere. Which looks pretty cool. Now it's just my Christmas tree. I think I put my large Christmas tree right here. Which doesn't give me a lot of room. What if I were to put the Christmas tree right here this year? It will be blocked by that. So I do love it with the large Christmas trees. But I feel like with the large Christmas tree it's just going to have to be the regular Christmas tree. Now, I don't think I'm going to decorate, do like a video of decorating my blocks for house for Christmas next year. And I think this video is already getting long. Um, so I'll, I'm just going to do like a little speed edit of my house a little real quick. And you guys can see the process that I'm doing. So right now, I'll do a speed build for the rest of the Christmas decorations that I want to put up in this video. And I'll um, give you guys a tour of it later. So let's just get right into this.
I think I got what I wanted finished with the house for now. It's like 429 on my way past my deadline to upload. Um, but I think I finished with what I wanted to do, like putting trees around and stuff like that, put some snowmen. Um, so here's just a little bit of a tour. So obviously there's just a lot of Christmas um, decorations out. You can obviously see where I put some more snowflakes down and all of this. I go all out for Christmas, so my house is going to be with all of this stuff and me being even more rich. I'm losing a lot of money, so I got to get some more money back so I can get my new SUV, which costs $1.60,000. Um, but I put some more Christmas trees down. I definitely did a lot of this. Um, I did some more of the path lights. Put some more trees down, bushes, and put down a giant Christmas tree right there. Obviously, I did that and I'll be open. And here we kind of have this. And there's just a lot of presents already stacked under the tree for Christmas. It's pretty cool. I wanted to do this since November 1st, but I didn't have enough time to do it. Um, and down here, I think I did put one Christmas decoration at the end of this haul, which was just a bat. And obviously, you can see just a little bit of illuminating of the blue light, which is right here for these icicle lights. I do want to change the color of the icicle lights, maybe, or just keep it where it's just the blue light is illuminating from there. Obviously, I did put some more snowflakes on these walls, but it's, my house is not completely decorated for Christmas yet. But I thought right now is a good time to have some stuff done for my um, house. As you can see there's still some more Christmas decorations in here. The wrapping paper is always going to stay in the storage room, so kind of this is neat. Um, I do have all this in the storage room. The snow globe, I forgot about the snow globes to put those around, so definitely going to do that. Now we're just going to head upstairs to my bedroom so we can see some of the decorations that we have put in the bedroom. Well, I put in my bedroom. Oh, we're just going up and up and up and up the elevator. And then right here, we have some two Christmas presents right here, which obviously we can now take these and carry them. I'm just going to place that back down. So those are now carryable. Um, we have a stocking, which we can add items to them. So look, I just, I'm just going to add like a something for me later like some more candy what if i just did you could put a cinder block in oh wow okay who has scented candles fabric kittens um let's just put in a crispy bar in there which now we're just adding see looks so cool now we also have some more stuff down in the basement as well which i'll just go down to the first floor so we can see some of the stuff that's in the first floor um, so go to floor one. I definitely did put some ornaments, and you can obviously see that this is just the um, snowman just coming to the floor. Um, that's just what all Bloxburg items do, don't know why. But I have been starting to stock up on Christmas items, so definitely do that. Um, obviously we have some Santas, um, and we're going to go back down in the basement. Again, I think I think there's some more stuff in the basement that I didn't get to. Um, but yeah, I did decorate this basement for Christmas, if you didn't see. I did start decorating it for Christmas. I think that's all the stuff I did. I think that's all the stuff I did in the house. Um, well, that's everything. Also, my new Christmas outfit. This, I had this last year, too. But thank you guys so much for watching. Um, if you guys did enjoy this video. Um, like and subscribe, and I hope to see you guys in the next one when I write post that one, which should be tomorrow. But anyways, I'll see you all later. Bye now.